In a world where fairy tales and reality collide, a story of love, resilience, and transformation unfurled before our eyes. The story of Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, a modern day romance that defied conventions and reshaped tradition. In mid-2016, Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's story began. According to the couple, they first connected with each other via Instagram and were set up on a blind date. They tied the knot in May 2018 and now have two lovely children, Archie and Lilibet. However, this fairy tale was far from a smooth journey as it navigated its way through a series of controversies and thus inspired Harry and Meghan, a docu-series about the Sussexes produced by Netflix and the couple's Archual Productions that premiered on December 8, 2022. Filmed in a Montecito mansion, this dwelling is more than a physical structure, becoming a living testament to their journey, a place where laughter, tears, and aspirations converged. As we step through the doors of Meghan Markle's Netflix house, we're transported into a world of luxury that mirrors the exceptional nature of their relationship. Every corner of this residence whispers tales of extravagance, seamlessly blending modern elegance with timeless charm. Designed with a touch of regal elegance, the Mediterranean-style abode boasts six bedrooms and spans an impressive 13,599 square feet. Offering breathtaking vistas of both ocean and mountains, the residence is adorned with numerous terraces. Inside a grandeur envelops the space enhanced by a majestic chandelier gracing the great room. Then there's the arched windows that frame each view, a space where Megan was extensively filmed for the show's interviews. Located in sunny California, the home was meticulously crafted in 2006. Surrounding the home's exterior lies an expansive landscape with two acres of lush grounds adorned with enchanting walkways and blooming flowers that grace the surroundings year round. The ambiance is further elevated by the presence of towering palm trees, artfully trailing vines, a vegetable garden, orchards, and even a charming chicken coop. There's also a picturesque guest house offering a haven fit for royalty or famous visitors seeking respite under the embrace of Southern California's weather. Graced with timeless elegance, the living room here boasts ceilings with wood paneling and delicate beams. From this opulent space, a seamless transition leads to an upper floor loggia, an expanse that stretches across the entire length of the home. Three arched French doors open to reveal an enchanting view, an infinity pool, and a sweeping crescent-shaped lawn. These same doors frame the backdrop for Megan's interviews in the documentary. A separate dining room is distinguished by a silver leaf domed ceiling and from here a portion of the upper lodges unfolds, a space with a fireplace and seating, offering a place for relaxation. The residence's open floor plan has an Eden chef's kitchen with soapstone sinks and marble topped island. Flowing seamlessly, this culinary space merges into an informal dining and living room. Here there are dark wide plank wood floors. The main level shows the opulent primary suite, a sanctuary with dual boutique style dressing rooms and ensuite baths. There's also an inviting pool that's perfect for leisurely dips or moments of relaxation. Among the residence's many highlights, there's a paneled study, a well-equipped gym, a captivating theater, and an inviting bar. Elsewhere, you'll find two games rooms, a five-car garage, and much more. In this mansion, each corner is a masterpiece, and every element, whether it's the soaring ceilings or the intimate covered patio, contributes to the elegance that defines this residence. Currently, this Montecito mansion is available for purchase at the sum of $33.5 million. This listing is being overseen by Ryan Malmston of Santa Barbara Brokers. Looking at the listing, you can see the captivating visuals that offer a glimpse into this enchanting property. However, the intrigue deepens when considering Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's connection to the house. Initial speculations swirled regarding them owning this residence, yet it was confirmed that the house belonged to someone else and they just rented it. According to sources, the Montecito mansion seen in the show is located about three and a half miles away from the couple's actual residence. 
Glimpses previously shared by the couple hint at a design similarity between the two houses, both embracing a laid back California cool aesthetic, completes with one distinctive feature, the chicken coop. Interestingly enough, the estate featured in the documentary was purchased by businessman Mark Shuloff in 2013 for around $14.6 million. As the narrative continues to unravel, the allure of this Montecito mansion remains intact, serving as a symbol of elegance and style that continues to captivate on and off the screen. However, irrespective of ownership, the mansion's stately presence becomes a part of Megan's journey, a backdrop to the chapters of her life that have played out both in the public eye and within the sanctuary of its walls. The elegance that this mansion embodies becomes a symbol not just of architectural beauty, but will forever be intertwined with Megan and their family. Now that will bring today's Meghan Markle's Netflix house tour to a close. But before we go, answer this question for me. Was it a disappointment that Meghan and Harry had to have their docu-series filmed in a different home, or was it wise to keep their family safe? Let me know in the comments below, and don't forget to like, subscribe, and follow me on Instagram to chat. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer, and I'll see you all in another video. Bye!